back to our channel இந்த வீடியோக்குள்ள போ முன்னாடி நீங்க ஒன்னும் நம்ம சேனல்ல சப்ஸ்கிரைப் பண்ணலாம் மறக்காம சப்ஸ்கிரைப் பண்ணிக்கோங்க வாங்க வீடியோக்குள்ள போலாம் சேனல் அண்ட் திஸ் வீடியோ வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு சால்வ் தி டுடேஸ் டெய்லி சேலஞ்ச் ஸோ பீப்புள் ஹாவ் மைட் சீன் ஃபார் த பாஸ்ட் டூ டேஸ் தேர் வில் தேர் ஆர் வீடியோஸ் வித்வுட் வாய்ஸ் so as i have some health issues so i am unable to use my own voice so i have tried to implementing the a voice but it uh, not perfectly matches with what i am just trying to say so just i left with no voice okay so and today i am going to solve this daily challenge okay so the question is four substrings to matrix so what we should do is we must accept n string values of equal length that is l as the input and we must divide each string into four substrings of equal length okay then we must uh, form a character matrix of size r cross c where r is equal to n into 3 and c is equal to L by 4 into 3, okay? Then we must fill the character matrix based on some conditions which they have given it here, okay? So what are the conditions of that? Top, top, top right, bottom left, bottom right and the middle sub matrices of this one must be filled with asterisk, okay? Asterisk you might know. These are the asterisk, okay? <coughs> and the top, middle, sub matrix of size must be filled with the first substring of the n string value and middle right substring will be filled with the second substring of the n value and similarly third and the fourth and finally we must print the r cross c character matrix as the output okay and they have given that the value of l is always divided by 4 okay and today i am going to solve this one using the python language only okay so i'm going to get the n value in my first line so l is equal to int input and the str val is very in the middle like this input dot strip and for underscore in range of n okay and getting the l len of str val all the first index and just mention like this and r comma c is equal to n into 3 comma l divided by 4 into 3 <coughs> okay as per the question we have given it and now we must initialize our matrix with a strict so matrix is equal to a strict for underscore in range of c okay and here for underscore in range of r so let me say the code once okay now we must looping through the all the conditions okay so first one is the i'm going to put for the top middle one so for row in range of n the matrix of row cross l by 4 is to l by 4 into 2 <coughs> this equal to list of str val of row n is to l divided by 4 okay this is the one for the top middle one now for row in range of n comma n into 2 the matrix of row is to l by 4 mm is equal to <coughs> mm 
list of init is equal to list of str val of row minus n cross minus of l by 4 and putting this one right here so this is the one which we are using for the so wait a minute uh, just remove this one and I'll replace this here okay yeah I think now it's correct this is one for the middle left we are just using this and now for the middle right so so for the middle right it can be given in the same line I think so matrix of row cross minus of L by 4 is to is equal to list of str val of row minus n cross l by 4 is to l by 4 into 2 okay this is one for the middle right and now for the bottom middle so for row in range of so let me save the code once again uh, n into 2 comma n into 3 the matrix of row cross l by 4 is to l by 4 into 2 is equal to list of strval uh, row minus n into 2 cross l by 4 into 2 is to l by 4 into 3 okay so we have left the square bracket somewhere I think so row minus okay mm -hmm. yeah this is in the parenthesis <coughs> okay I think now it's correct okay let me save the code and now for row in matrix we must print join all the rows okay so now let us run our code and check whether we are getting any error yeah you can see that our code has been successfully passed without getting any error and that happened in my first try though so thank you for watching this one so as you know that our channel name has been changed and some content related has been changed I have received some comments that uh, why didn't you keep the same name or why didn't you why are you changing the content so I will just mention it my upcoming videos why it has tend to me to do that so don't worry I will just keep posting and my main motto is just posting many coding videos since I have some exams and something so as and, and my health issue is also somewhat low so that I am unable to post the videos frequently with my voice 
so that's the problem so if i am good and everything is perfect i will just make daily videos and i have kept many scripts to make videos related to the coding and some important coding questions which have been asked so far so i will just post it on stay tuned and thank you for supporting till now and thank you for watching this video please do like share subscribe for more videos thank you i will see you in the next video